Hey everyone, my name is Rashida. Welcome to my channel. I make travel videos in which I share my bargain travel tips in hopes to inspire you to plan your best life and see the world for yourself. In today's video, join us as we go on a family friendly outing to New York. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you want to see more travel videos like this one. Without further ado, let's explore the world and all its frugal opportunities. Join me as I head out for the day to Manhattan. I'm ready, are you ready? For today's outing, because we were commuting, I wanted this trip to be convenient, educational, as well as a fun time for my toddler and us adults. This guide features our commute from New Jersey to New York. I requested an Uber to the train station and boarded the train to New York Open Penn Station at, at 34th time. Street. And until further notice, eating and drinking is not permitted on board the train. Thank you for your cooperation. At New York Penn Station, we boarded the number one train and got off at 79th Street and Broadway. We walked five minutes to West 83rd Street to get to the Children's Museum of Manhattan. They're open Wednesday through Sunday from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. You have to reserve a timed ticket online and choose a tour. We went with the Playful Explorer tour for ages two to six. Included with your tour is stroller check. We checked in our belongings and headed upstairs to the third floor. At the beginning of your tour, a team member provides each child with a personal drawstring bag full of sanitized toys. In case you're wondering, they do have a clean team that is continuously disinfecting the equipment. Because there is a limited capacity, there is more space for your child to safely climb and move as they play and explore. There are many activities that allow your child to play, learn, and imagine while exploring math, physics, reading, and art. On this floor, there was lots to explore. Olivia was able to climb into a fire engine, drive an MTA bus, feed Alfie the alphabet eating dragon, and even cook and shop at a deli. My daughter is currently two years old. This museum provided the best environment where we as a family were able to play and imagine with her as she expressed herself and learned about the surroundings of her city. We were able to enjoy ourselves without having to worry about cleaning up after any mess. As part of our Playful Explorer tour, we went down to the second floor for adventures with Dora and Diego. On this floor, we were able to explore music and a few animals from the rainforest. While your child can enjoy their free play, there are educator-led experiences such as story time and dancing. After exploring the second floor, we decided to head out to our next destination. It was approximately a 10 minute walk to the American Museum of Natural History, which is right across the street from the west side of Central Park. Food trucks were in the area and they accepted credit cards. Admission to the museum requires a reservation. If you are a New Jersey, Connecticut, or New York resident, the price you pay for admission would be up to you. Otherwise, it would be $23 for adults, $13 for children ages 3 to 12, or $18 for students. 
This museum is open from 10 a.m. to 5.45. There are many beautiful exhibits. It might take you more than one visit to explore it all. There is a food court and two cafes offering gourmet or light meals and snacks open from 11 a.m. to 4.45. With keeping my toddler's interest in mind, for this visit we only explored exhibits with animals, some fossils, the environment, and a little bit of human culture. My daughter enjoys the show Dinosaur Train and likes to pretend that she is one. I'm glad she was able to see a few fossils for herself. Out of all the exhibits we visited on this trip, the Biodiversity and Ocean Life Hall were my favorite. They were based on the ocean's ecosystem. The lighting in the Ocean Life Hall is very dim. A few of the exhibits could not be captured on camera. My favorite piece that is a must see is of a squid attacking a shark. We decided to call it quits after the Ocean Life exhibit. Until next time, my friends. <laughs>